Hello everybody, welcome to our local business showcase here at Suburban. Today we are interviewing Dwight Lopez with Dwight's Glass and Tint here in Green Valley. Dwight, thanks for having us. Yeah, thank you for coming. So our first question of the day, what is your favorite part about owning this type of business? Uh, just interacting with uh, different clients. Our business does a variety of uh, different things like alarm stereos, window tint, auto glass, repair and replacement, residential glass, showers. Nice. So. We do a bunch of different stuff, it so it's always yeah. an adventure. <laughs> <laughs> and you do it with your family too, right? Yep. Or a portion of your family? Okay. Yep. So I imagine that's pretty awesome to yep. be able to do it beside your family. Yeah, got my son here, my sister, my dad. Um, yeah, we all work together. So Dwight, uh, when did you decide to take the leap and start your own business? Um, it was after high school. Um, a couple years after high school, I was been doing it since I was 13 years old with my father. He opened in 1986 in Tucson. So from 20 years old, I moved down here to nice. Saurita and decided to open up a spot. All right, so when I was actually doing some research for your business in this interview, I saw that you had a ton of Google reviews. Mm -hmm. And so the next question is, how do you maintain and procure so many five-star reviews? Um, I mean, first off, we bring in you know the customer and whatever we're doing, we try hard to make sure we get it done right. Yeah. Timely manner, especially. It's hard right now, especially with this COVID stuff. We're getting uh, companies that can produce, you know, enough tint, glass. Mm -hmm. um, it's just been pretty hard. So we've been trying to communicate, you yeah. know, for all three, especially the last couple of years. But usually when we get the job done, we try to have our customer do a review. I mean, yeah. it's very important um, that, you know, they do a review because people don't say anything unless there's, they're gonna complain about something. Right. <laughs> so um, we try, Sorry. you know, having the customer do a review so you know what it's out there yeah. you know what's going on here um, but we try to take care of our customers and when we're not perfect but when it does happen we try to fix it can't make everybody happy right. but we try yeah like when i came in here just this morning i definitely felt like a family friendly environment so i think that's really welcoming for people more so than the corporate type feeling, you know? So last question, Dwight, how do you see this business growing locally here in the next five years? We just keep on maintaining the same yeah. uh, level of business and, you know, um, customer service. Uh, I hope we get bigger, but it's just running out of room here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. We just do a lot more things mobile instead of bringing people out of their homes. And, yeah. And maybe uh, idea, we yeah. do a little bit of mobile tinting, like mm -hmm. on cars, we'll go to your garage tent if you don't want to come out um, a lot of stuff we can do at home um, but other than that I mean that's pretty much the next plan for the next couple of years. Awesome. So for everyone watching thank you for tuning in thank you to Dwight you. and Dwight's Glass and Tent for having us um, for anyone watching where can they find out more about you and your business? Uh, we're on Google uh, we're okay. still on the phone book a lot of people still use the phone book the Green Valley right, phone book right. uh, we're pretty much all uh, social media cool. um, like I said you can look us up Pretty easy. We've been around since, like I said, 2002. Cool. And so we're out there. Awesome, Dai. Well, thank you. thank you. And for everyone watching, we will see you in the next one.